So originally, um, Nova and I met in, Queen, in Queensland Health in the public health system, um, and we we basically came across the idea accidentally. Um, we were listening to we went out to a palliative care evening. Um, and it was to raise money for a palliative care service. Um, we sat and watched a movie about an Indian doctor um, who was incredible um, and saw an opportunity for humanitarian health care. He was literally taking people who were dying in the streets and he took them um, into a facility that he, he made out of really a warehouse and things um, and allowed, gave them pain relief and allowed them to die with dignity. And the question around this was, what are you doing for your most vulnerable? Mm. And it was, a, it was a fundraiser and there was wine involved and networking. Um, <laughs> and instead of heading off after the movie to do that, we kind of sat in the chair and went... Well, we sat back in our seats. And <laughs> went, well, what are we doing are in our doing? managerial roles in the public sector to help? Yeah. Um, we thought we were doing great things in, in the hospital system. Um, and then we realised there was a whole cohort of people who weren't either were inappropriately accessing healthcare or weren't accessing it. Mm. Um, so, you know, that was quite confronting for us. It was. We, we knew that we were helping people once they'd got through the front doors of the mm. hospital. But what about all the people who never got through the front doors of yeah. the hospital? And so that's where Sonia and I really started thinking outside the box and outside the system, most mm. importantly, um, and, and came to the conclusion that actually we were going to be able to create a bigger impact from outside the system than we were able to inside mm. the system. Yeah.